Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a personalized product listing with Printed Man. In this tutorial, I'll show you how I personalized this luggage tag for every person who ordered it. Okay, so first you got to make sure you're logged in to your Printed Mint account. Go up to the top right hand corner, click My Account, and then you're going to go to this left hand tab and click My Stores. So go over to your Etsy shop and click Settings. And then you're going to scroll down all the way until you get to approval and billing options. Make sure you select all approve and pay for orders manually as they come in. That's the second option right here. This is important because you need the chance to edit and personalize that product before it goes in through our production line. Okay, next up, we're going to talk about designing. So for this tutorial, I'm going to design a luggage tag. So I'm going to click on the product catalog. Navigate to the product you want. Here's the luggage tag with buckle. Okay, I clicked on the product. Now I'm going to click design. Okay, and I already made a design in Canva. So the important thing is when you make the base design, you want to make sure it has room for all of your personalized details to be inputted using our design editor. So I'm going to go over here to my files. Here's my luggage tag. And then I'm going to go ahead and add a few text layers. And I'm just going in and inputting example names and addresses and everything so that way when somebody does order it's already the right font size the right font all i have to do is go ahead double click and change that name i'm going to add another text this is where my customer will put in their address once i have it looking how i want it to look just go ahead and click next click save and then click submit to shop Submit to selected shops. Okay, something to note is that when you go to your listing in Etsy, you need to have personalization options turned on. This will allow your customers' personalization options to show up in the order drafts on your Printed Mint account. Let me show you what I mean. Okay, so when somebody buys this product, I'm going to go to my account, my orders, and there's one order draft right here. This is the order. I'm not going to just go ahead and approve this item, even though it is synced to this correct product, because I need to personalize it. So before I approve it, I need to click edit. Okay, so when you get to this part, you're going to see the personalization options right here. Go ahead and write this down on a piece of paper, or you can copy and paste just to make things a little easier so that you remember exactly what those personalized options are. Do not click either of these buttons, design, new, or add existing, because it'll add another item to your order. So just go ahead and click edit here to personalize the item. When you click edit, you'll see a few options. I'm going to click personalize. Make sure you're on the layers tab. Every layer is a different piece of information. So jackpot, that was the name. I'll go ahead and click edit. So Beth Murray, that's the name. Now I'll go back to the layers tab. Next section is the one, two, three main street. So go ahead and click edit. And then I'll just go back to layers. And then for the last one, the phone number. Okay, from here, I can go ahead and adjust these however I see fit. So I'm just gonna space them out a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and click next. There is my product. And I'll click save. Save and exit shipping options, everything like that. And then from there, I'll just go ahead and click approve. All right, thanks for watching guys. Have a great day and remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more Printed Mint YouTube videos and tutorials.